On the inside of the foldable, at the top left, let's look at gas molecules. Gas molecules move quickly, freely, and are far apart. The top right, let's describe gases. Gases have no definite volume. Gases have no definite shape. Okay, the arrow on the outside of your foldable is pointing up from a liquid to a gas. This is called boiling. Boiling of water happens at 212 degrees Fahrenheit. This process is endothermic because it requires heat energy to make this process happen. On the other side of your foldable, we have an arrow pointing down from gas to liquid. This is called condensation. Condensation happens at the same temperature as boiling, only we're going from a gas to a liquid. This happens at 100 degrees Celsius. This process is exothermic because it releases heat energy as the process happens. If we go down to the next section, we're looking at liquid molecules. Liquid molecules slide past each other with more energy than solid molecules and less energy than gas molecules. If we look at liquids, liquids have definite volume liquids have no definite shape. If we look at the arrow going from solid to liquid, we call this melting. Melting point of water is 32 degrees Fahrenheit. Again, this process is endothermic because it requires energy, heat energy, to make it happen. If you look at the arrow of liquid going to solid, we call this freezing. Freezing happens at the same temperature as melting, which is 32 degrees Fahrenheit, or zero degrees Celsius.
This process is exothermic because heat energy is released during this process. The last picture on the left is a picture of solid molecules. Solid molecules vibrate in place. Solids have definite volume Solids have definite shape. Okay, let's turn your foldable over to the back and talk about some vocabulary words. When we talk about solid liquid and gas molecules and how they move and react to changes in temperature, we're talking about kinetic molecular theory. And kinetic theory explains the physical properties of matter by the motion of its particles. A couple other changes of states that we did not mention. Uh, when we mention exothermic, reaction, these reaction give off energy and include condensation, freezing, and deposition. Deposition is the change of state from gas to solid. We also talked about endothermic reactions. These reactions take energy in and include boiling, melting, and sublimation. Sublimation is the change of state of matter from solid to gas.